totally not stalking the chocolate covered strawberries in the Wicked Spoon Buffet this morning. I'm not honest. Okay, so maybe I lied. So I know we showed this yesterday morning, but uh, wow. We've just spoke to somebody and she said um, it's only going to get worse this week with it being Thanksgiving week. But we walked past a huge queue on the way in this morning. It was about 10 o'clock when we came for breakfast. And uh, we walked past a huge queue in the normal line and got straight to the front of the VIP line and was sat down like within three minutes of arriving. Um, but when we've come out now, this is obviously Tuesday, it is around half 11, so the brunch has started. Um, which means they kind of bring different food out, like crab's legs. I mean, the queue for the crab's legs is huge. Um, but we're, we've got a big shock coming out today. So this closest line to us is the VIP line. And everything you see past that one line is normal. Um, just guests rolling up. But this is how long both queues are right now. So this on the left is the VIP line, we've never seen more than about 10 people in that, that is all the way down there, and this is the regular line. Yeah, and it is so long. We mentioned this morning when we arrived to the lady who kind of gets you seated that the queue was right down here and she said at the time if you go as far back as this it's about a three hour wait just keeps going i mean yeah the brunch is really good in there but i'm not sure that it would be worth losing three hours of vegas time well i know it's not nearly all the way back to the dog statues so we are just about to head into our favorite looking uh, hotel on the strip which is New York New York absolutely love the atmosphere in this casino it's been mildly lucky for us before in the past actually I'd say it's not been unlucky it's the only place that I've ever got the Foo Babies bonus, actually. <laughs> Do we dare go down the Foo Babies route again? Tell you what, the Foo Babies seem very harmless now compared to the bloody parrots. Okay, let's go.
New York, New York, and Lindsay has just said the words that all crazy people in Vegas eventually say, which is, I really want to go on hike. And this apparently is the lucky one, isn't it, Lindsay? Well, last time we were here, which is, you know, last year, somebody on this machine, we saw them get 125 free games. And it's been in my head ever since that I'm going to come back and I'm going to play this game and maybe I'll get 125 free games too. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Oh yeah, just give her a spin. Some drinks. So we have 30 spins here. Believe me, this bonus has been harder. Literally just wanted the song, really, you know. Just like for a little bit of music. Switch over to this one. At the 
moment and certainly panning out on the first half produced more than the second half of swings. Oh my god. It was nine dollars. Only two left. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Fifty nine dollars, you know, it's not a bad little bonus. That is such a fun one if you can't get it. It was only one dollar bet as well. Yeah. I should, I should have mentioned that. One, one dollar bet. That, I, I, I think this game, you know, it's the ultimate fun if you can get it, and the ultimate frustration if you can't. I think Heidi's heaven because she didn't give us too much money. Is that what you think? Playing Zeus and um, it wasn't paid out. Then Lindsay put it on the naughty step, and, so, um, and by that she means that she she stops playing it for a while while she waits for a drink. And um, I was actually immediately hit, like so much it's taken us by surprise. So it's actually now went on to, went on to the highest base scale as well. Last spin though, this unless we get one. Heidi money. You well, it was a bit more than 15. You'd think you? that was more than 15, but that was just a one dollar bet, yeah. I guess. Um, it was just one of the, 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 the little ones that hits out of nowhere. But anyway, naughty step, think about it. Think about it. So look what we're back on. Now Lindsay swore that she was that she wasn't gonna play this she swore that she was done with the foo babies and yet she couldn't resist but this is the only place that i've ever hit the foo babies bonus actually i've just looked and the pot is really empty so i'm thinking we might move the machine well that one's even emptier and the one next to us is like taken right are we gonna risk it then so i mean we've, she says that she's only gonna play 50. 60. Well, she said that to me that she was only going to play. Because I only had 20s. So. Right, so we'll probably be moving on from here in the next kind of six minutes. Well, but she might have a really good six minutes. And I got sex on the beach. And, she, and she's had sex on the beach. Um, and a drink as well, so. You know what, let's, let's just let it run. Because you never know what might happen. You'll either see a miracle, or you'll see how fast Lindsay <laughs> loses all of her money on dancing drums. Either way, it's got to be worth seeing, right? I want a whole dollar there. Yes! Oh, yes! A miracle indeed, right. This is, I knew it. I knew this machine, I knew it. So, just so, just in case anybody doesn't know, you pick any three of these and then you win the mini. I feel like we might win the major today. Just, just got to ride on the major. <laughs> Anything but the mini really is like a massive bonus, isn't it? I'm so excited, this is what I wanted. Right, what we're picking? You know what, maybe I should do the picking this time. Then. But you know, I'll just shout at you if it goes wrong. Yeah. Right. I have never picked through baby before. No, he hasn't. Oh. Right, so the gold, I think, is the grand. Is that right? Right, that's another grand. Now, hang on a minute. Just stop there, because that's $14,000. So I'm pretty sure that's what the gold is. I may it's, be wrong. It's important to note, though, that we're not winning. Hang on, 
does it, it doesn't even look like there is a gold. Because oh, that's, that's red, surely. Anyway. Yeah, that's, that's a Red little things, gold little holy things. Right, come on then. You'd think I would know this by now. I've just never got close to winning that. Now, the green is one we don't want, okay? But the green is the one that we are getting. We don't want the greens. Michael, I said no more greens. Oh, man! $11. <laughs> we wasted the poo baby bonus there. No, oh, that's not the case. <laughs> I can't I believe it. I do like it. the fact that I've made you wait for it for a little amount of time to basically stole it off you. <laughs> we're, um, we're playing Re Regal Riches. Um, sorry, it's a big glare on the screen there. From something high. Um, I've got it from here. That's right, but anyway, we've just hit the kind of free games bonus. You've only got 35 guaranteed wilds for these 10 free games. It's just click on a minor one. Let's see what it what, what it gives out. Press the star. So the wilds tick down as they get handed out. I guess you want them kind of used sparingly, and then a couple spins all at once. Good, there's not really playing out at the minute. There's four free games left and 22 miles still to go. So we're going to get 12 wilds on the last spin, essentially. So let's go for it. Well, it's shaping and ringing. Could have been nice, I couldn't have with all them wild. So. Could have been, but you know. Anyway, total win 41 cents. I've just had a $37 line hit. And we had, well. yeah, and we had a $37 line hit on this. Yeah, um, literally the wilds are the Yeah, literally, next spin. They kind of, you kind of um, collect wilds normally in the, like randomly as they go up there. And then occasionally it just kind of spits them out. So that was kind of the, the next spin and it spat out all the wilds that was collected and it's a $17 line hit. So I actually think that this game pays fairly well, you know. I really do. are beautiful they are absolutely gorgeous we used to get angry orchards in the casino when we were gambling but i asked for one today and she said that they just don't have them anymore um so we ended up getting baileys and sex and city and stuff like that so so um yeah they, these are beautiful and we've had amazing food as well haven't yeah. we amazing food amazing service and the, the waitress here of tom's urban has been lovely We've been chatting for about 20 minutes to her, haven't we? <laughs> she loves our sports the same as us, and uh, she was really, really lucky. So yeah, so we've, the idea is that we finish these off, and um, we're gonna head up towards Harris. 
so we've had a great day though. We love New York, New York. We just absolutely, every time we come, we love it even more. Uh, regardless of kind of what happens with the gambling, we just love the atmosphere and the vibe and we just feel really comfortable here, don't we? I think it's my favourite strip. Yeah. See it Other than Cosmo, obviously. Yeah. And Tom's Urban's always a really good place. Oh, it just, it's fantastic. just really nice. By the way, you can take these home with you. I think you said there were 25 or 35. 25, I think. But one of these is coming home with me. Let's see if it gets home or not. Last time we took something home, we carried a vase all the way home. And then our daughter smashed it. Survived a flight. <laughs> but, you know, couldn't survive Scarlet. No. Anyway, uh, cheers, everyone. Love this.
the crowd shovels in. Bonnie's blowing on that dirty harmonica. You have no idea where that's been. <laughs>
we've just been in there. The piano bar down there. What a fantastic night. That was um, Bonnie Mason, our friend, who you know, you'll have seen her by now. She's absolutely amazing. And that was a bit of a kind of a special show with with someone just as good, to, to, to be honest with you. We were actually, um, Lindsay and I were talking earlier and um, we kind of agreed that that Caesars and like MGM Grand are are two properties that we just don't even, even ever think about of visiting. And it's a little bit weird, I guess, because the two of the kind of, I would say, the biggest names on this the kind of strip. But we just got no affection for either of them. It's a little bit strange, I guess. But it is what it is. Cosmo is looking quite far away when you walk into it. Um, anyway, it's a good night. We'll see what we'll do next, if anything. Um, this is a, this rarely happens. First thing we've actually won something. So this never happens to us at all. We just won one yeah, 250 we'll put, bags. We'll put a hundred in and just did one of 250 bags. <laughs> now, oh, with those 750 line hits, probably the best that we'll get out of it. We know it's fun. By the way, we're just back in now. We can't stop. It's been a long day, we've drank a lot. We've had a fantastic day. So, um, a few spins later and we've got some free games. But I'm, I'm, I'm sure that you've noticed that the home spin's been elusive for this, this holiday. But you know, we actually won the, the 500 on the first night on just normal free games on a uh, good line hit. So. Ready? Yeah, ready. Watch it. I'm not sure if we've ever played this variant of that. Uh, of Dragon Duck. Not Nothing at all happening. Last three spin. So no hold spin but another thirty three fifty. So I've got another uh, three games feature. Um, probably eight like eight or nine spins on from our our last um, our last little win. Chasing the elusive home spin. I mean, there, there doesn't even seem to be a ball rattling around in there. No? Well, you know, we're not going to complain about the 33 dollar bonds. So the elusive home spin has landed. It's kind of already, well there's a mini which is 10, so there's what, well, 30, 55, then up to 12, 50, they're already looking at kind of 60 plus. Well the last time that we got a hold spin, it was just a spin, there wasn't any hold going. So uh, let's see if we get any more luck this time. 
to be honest, it's already a, a fairly nice bonus. Twenty-seven, twenty-five, going in there. Come on. Yeah, it's just going to be the whole end of the spin and the, the whole. Spin. Of the... Come on, just get the one. Keep seeing it. It's around 2am, we've just got back to the room, um, I know Michael kind of talked you through us walking home but when we got back uh, in the Cosmo we obviously had a little bit of luck on um, Dragon Link. Um, it's been one of those machines, um, slots, other than the first night where we were really successful, we've had um, very kind of not great luck on it to be honest. Um, but we just thought, oh, you know, we're going to just, we had our last hundred for the day on our budget. We put the hundred in, literally first um, spin we got something and then we ended up getting two pot bonuses and the holding spin and a few other line hits. So we were like, oh, this is great at the end of the day, just a little bonus. So anyway, we put a hundred in, we took 200 out and then that's put away for another day. So it was a nice little way to finish the day. Um, we are tired now, it has been a very long day, but we've had such a, such a good day. And uh, we're looking forward to getting some sleep. Um, obviously, Dr. Orchard has helped today. So, fingers crossed. <laughs> 